I'm Mavis Fittimore. I'm a member from Ottawa Acorn since about 2012. I want to talk to you about some of the things that I remember in my past history with Acorn. Uh, here's a good story. Around 2016, Acorn members in Ottawa South were very dissatisfied with Mr. Cuche and his response to our demands for um, changes at Heron Gate. So we planned an ambush. He used to like to have his Saturday chats with constituents at Second Tup on Ottawa's Bank Street. So we managed to pack two busloads of people together and we went down there and as he exited the building, we ambushed him and surrounded him with our chants and our complaints with him of not supporting the tenants. Finally, finally, he decided to speak and he broke down and said, okay, fine, he did support the tenants. With a big cheer, finally, we got our own <laughs> <laughs> counselor to be on board helping the tenants. That was a big thing for Ottawa South. We really needed to get that kind of political support. Um, another uh, thing that I remember very well was the convention in 2015 in Montreal. The action that happened there. It was the biggest action I had ever seen and getting people from all across Canada to march through Montreal was also a big deal too. And we managed to uh, push our way into the building for the Bank of Montreal because our action that day had to do with getting banks to realize that they underserved lower income people. And of course, they also were making money through the, their ownership of payday lenders. So we all marched in there, a huge mob, mob of us, took over the main floor where the tellers were and everything else. Luckily, the security people were just kind of smiling and not too worried about us. But we also had these beautiful big posters and inflatable sharks. <laughs> I remember that very well because <laughs> it was very impressive. So that was a great time for us. And it was a great feeling of community that we were all together in this from all across Canada. So it made a big impression on me. Now, um, another incident that I really liked was in Heron Gate itself. We uh, had, of course, our big demonstrations in Heron Gate and one of the best ones was one at the corner of Sandalwood and Heron Road and we had a huge school bus <laughs> that was there that was part of our demonstration. What was great about that demonstration that really made me feel good was the fact that we didn't just have people from Ottawa South there. We had people from chapters all over Ottawa. That support meant so much to us. It was great to have that kind of support and swell our numbers. And of course, I have to give a very big shout out to the artist who made our great school bus, and that was Giselle from the Vanier chapter. So thank you so much. Giselle and thank you so much people from all across Ottawa that meant a lot to the people in Ottawa South to see your contribution. Now finally there's one really important thing I feel has to be said and I have to say thank you to ACORN and all of its great organizers. Everybody from Alex who recruited me to all the fine people who helped me like Jill, Robin, Adele, Ode, Kyla, Ashley, Chelsea, Judy, Christian, Yuko, and so many more. Before ACORN, I knew nothing of people power. And the problems of other low income and marginalized people also I knew nothing about. You taught me and 130,000 other members across Canada to use my political power for good. Thanks a million. Love you all and keep up the good work. Yay, A card! <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs>